Harvest spring, like everything's new. The sun bursts flowers. Yonder music. So today is the first day of me going back to college. So I got up today and I was just going to get in the shower and put on makeup and blah, blah, blah. But then I was like, why not film it? Because somebody out there might want to watch it. But today I'm starting my sophomore year of college. Well, I actually started it like my sophomore year in the summer. But yeah, so I'm just going to like be doing my makeup and doing my hair. And I'm going to show you all like my really cool hair dryer thingy that I like really like. And then, oh, look at my um, like little towel. It's like elastic. I got it from Target. It was like $9. And I love it. And I have an orange cat. So I was like, crazy cat lady times 10. I'm actually kind of excited today um, to go back to college. I don't really like want to do the work again. But it'll be good to like get back in a schedule, kind of. Um, I do have three online classes, which is going to probably kick my tail. But we'll see. I don't have to be at college until until like 9 30 and i think it's 7 40 ish or something right now so i had to hurry a little but uh it'll be okay but okay so i gotta stop talking or i won't get ready so i'm gonna just like play through me drying my hair and then i'll show you the products that i use <laughs> Okay, so in this part where I do my makeup, I just decided to do a voiceover because it would have took a million years if I didn't. So I started with my Too Faced Primer Spray, it's probably like primer and setting, and then I went in with my Born This Way Foundation by Too Faced, also I'm pretty sure, um, in the shade Vanilla. And then here's me putting on um, concealer, it's my NARS Radiant Concealer in the color Nougatine. I'm not really sure what that word means, but yeah, I really like this concealer, and I, it's really, like, nice. Okay, and then there's me putting on um, Laura Mercier setting powder, and I went in with my Wet n Wild, like, eyebrow pencil. It's in, like, the shade medium, I'm pretty sure, and then I just wiped all of my powder off with a kabuki brush that I got in 2000. 12 <laughs> no i'm just kidding it was like 2016 or something and then i use my um my tarte clay play volume 2 palette to do my blush contour and highlighter so that's cool and then i just took like a morphe palette and honestly just like mixed a whole bunch of different browns together and put them on my eye and then i have to do my lashes because my lashes are so bad because i had lash extensions rest in peace lashes Okay, so I gotta make this quick or I'm gonna be late to school, but I just got this really cute like baby doll top. It's like got little flowers on it, um, like green and, and blue, and it's from, this is from American Eagle. And then I'm wearing a green scrunchie <laughs> to match, and then I'm just wearing my mom jeans from Target. I don't really like the, the way that they make my belly pooch, but I got to go and I don't have time to be indecisive. <laughs> and then I'm just wearing my white Converse that are kind of yellow at this point, but it's fine. I was gonna wear a necklace, but I don't I can't find one and I'm like really gotta go. And I'm so annoyed because our air isn't working and it's so freaking hot in here. Up today of all days our air was not working. Oh, and I'm gonna about to put on this perfume. It's Coconut Passion by Victoria's Secret.
It is 9 10 and it takes me 22 minutes to get there and I need to be there at 9 30 so let's see if I can make it um as I said earlier my air isn't working it's literally colder outside right now than it is inside my house and it is, is uh, 80 degrees outside currently right now and it's hot so but I'm really hoping today's gonna be a good day oh my god I just remember I didn't curl my lashes before I left oh my god why is everything not going my way but you know what I just need to chill Focus on getting this this gum out of my braces and focus on getting to school. So I will update y'all whenever that may be. <laughs> you can definitely tell that it's um fall semester. There's no parking anywhere. It took me 10 minutes to find a freaking parking spot. And it is currently 924. So I'm about to go in. I gotta pee and then uh, all those good seats are probably gone in the lecture hall, but it's okay. So let's do it. Hey guys, so I officially like survived the first the first uh, day back at college. I cannot tell you how many um, freshmen there were and there was a lot of um, like Viesco girls like I noticed I was like oh my god I'm happy with the outfit that I wore today and um, it was very very hot and after class I had to uh, go get my books in the bookstore and the like I literally sat in line for over an hour um, waiting on my books so yeah. But I'm finally home now and I haven't eaten so, or I haven't eaten, 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 I haven't eaten <laughs> and I'm about to eat something. I might have to go to Walmart. I'm like really craving fruit and I need to get some stuff at Walmart anyway so I might go do that and just like bring you along with me to like keep us a vlog. But yeah, I'm like really happy with my classes this term and hopefully it'll be a good, a good semester. Um, I'm thinking like at the end of this video I might do like some college advice for freshmen if y'all be like into that. I would like, I would like to do that. So I thought I could show you my little uh, book haul really quick. Okay, so last year, when you go to the bookstore, you like you just give them your schedule. Uh, the people that work there get you the books, and they bring them back out, and you pay for them. This year, for some reason, they had like lines of aisles. I guess like they had like aisles of different books, and they were um, all like categorized by like what subjects and what class and everything. But like there was so many people in that little area, so we all had to like find your own books, and then you just go to the cash register and pay for them. And then once you get like once you get done looking for them which took like 30 minutes because everybody's like like crammed together so you have to like move really slow you have to wait in line for another like 30 minutes that's what i had to do but anyway so i have five classes right so i figured out that for one class the book is online for free um for one class there was this girl i was talking to she's gonna sell it to me for 20 dollars so i'm gonna get that and i have two right now that are online they're my math classes and then you have to have like an access code to do like your software online I got these two math books at the bookstore. This one is, um, I think this one is Math 100, which is a really easy math. And then this, then this one is Math uh, 231, which is math for an elementary teacher education major. I want you to guess. I want you to guess how much those two books were. Okay, just guess. Just guess. You guessed. Okay. So th just those two books were $349.53. <laughs> Textbooks are expensive, like. Okay, so this is very random. I have my backpack on and I'm ready to go to Walmart, but it's been very hot today. But anyways, so I'm like really ready to eat and I want to have something to eat when I get back home uh, when I go grocery shopping and, uh, oh, I gotta get my bags. What? So, um, I am obsessed with zucchini, so I was like, I'll make myself some zucchini and I really like it on the grill. 
salt, pepper. This Cajun seasoning is so good. I had a good bit because I like it spicy, but a little bit of garlic powder, a little bit of onion powder, just a smidge of olive oil. And then when they're done, um, I put butter on them, but they are so good. Try it. Ugh. Okay, so I'm home from Walmart. I'm feeling on my phone because my camera died, like always. I really got to go to Best Buy and get me some more like battery packs. And excuse my makeup, it's very bad. It's been probably almost 12 hours since I put this makeup on. Anyways, I just wanted to show y'all like a cute little, or like, a quick little haul of what I got at Walmart. Um, speaking of makeup, I got like this set. I used to use this in like 10th and 11th grade and it was amazing. I don't know why I stopped using it, but, and then I found this lipstick that was really cute. It's in uh, matte surface, so that's funny. But yeah, and it's like a really cute, just like nude. Oh, on camera it does not look nude, but in real life it's nude. <laughs> I got this hook thing to hang up in the kitchen to hang towels on. And I got just like um, these little like uh, strips to hold up to five pounds. And I might like do a fast forward video of me putting it on the wall. Some hummus and carrots. I am a huge snacker and I'm just been, like really trying to find healthier snacks. So hopefully I'll like this. This is roasted garlic hummus. I've had the um the roasted red pepper one and I did not like it at all. Okay, so I got this for supper. I got me some uh, veggie dogs because I'm gonna try this on the grill. I've never had these, but hopefully they'll be good. And I can't convince my boyfriend to be vegetarian with me. So I got him some uh, chicken legs and these were um, no hormones, free range. If I'm gonna buy him like meat and stuff, I'm gonna make sure that um, they were treated right. So I think this is a good brand. I've heard it is. Purdue is a pretty good brand. So yeah, three diet. Excuse me, three diet Mountain Dews because my boyfriend loves them. I don't like them, but he he likes to drink them. Strawberries, blueberries. And a fruit cup that has like cantaloupe, cucumber, grapes, and a piece of honeydew. Uh, these things are extremely overpriced, I know, but I was just like really hungry and I'm probably about to eat this right now, so. end of my first day back to college vlog I hope you enjoyed it I know it wasn't very exciting but it was just you know my experience of going back to college yeah I'm very happy for the teachers I had this time and hopefully it'll be a good time but I just wanted to end this video with like some freshman advice I guess um, I took six classes my first semester in 2018 fall of 2018 I took five classes um, spring and then I took four classes this past summer and this semester I'm taking five so I got all of my like um associate's degree done in pretty much a year so this December I will be done with my associate's degree and like by any means no one has to do that I just wanted to do that and looking back now I honestly wish I would have just faced it out because um I don't really want it to go by so fast and I don't know why I'm rushing it like from here on out like when I go to the university I'm gonna spend as much time as I need there to do well and not be so stressed out because I just feel like there's no point in that you have to work your whole life anyways so just don't rush have t have fun and enjoy your experiences and make memories that's my biggest thing just make memories and don't stress too much but about the whole like college topic my visit, biggest advice is don't procrastinate i'm sure you, every one of y'all always hears that but don't procrastinate get things done and then you'll have plenty of time to um, be stress free and worry about other things you need to worry about also i would suggest when you get syllabuses your professor will always have a syllabus most of them will have like will have typed out 
each day what you're going to be doing um, for the whole semester. And I think it's really helpful if you print all of those out. So you have it in front of you. Uh, you won't forget. You won't have to go on the computer and look it up. You just have it like in your binder or you hang it up in your room, you know. Uh, so you can always be reminded of when due dates are, what you need to be on top of. That's like a really big thing um, I could say. Like that's like the biggest thing. So in my experience of being at community college, I have made a good few friends and I think it's very helpful when you have friends in your classes because if you're out for a day and you want to know what you miss, you can just text them and be like, hey, you know, uh, what I miss? Instead of like trying to find somebody's college email and message some random stranger and be like, hey, what I miss? Like, I just feel like it's, and, and you get those memories and then you'll take these people with you for the rest of your life. Some people, people I'm friends with at college right now, I'm more close to than the people I was in, with in high school. But this is all my personal experience. Everyone's experience is different. I guess the final thing I should say is just don't stress too hard. The first semester, I literally would come home, study 24 seven, eat and sleep. And that just was not good for my mental health. Um, about halfway through the semester, I would literally come home and pass out. Like, I would, like, sleep until, like, 11 o'clock, and then I would study and do homework, and then I would go to sleep late in the night or, like, early in the morning, and then do it all over again. It just, it wasn't healthy, and once you take away from this, is like, if you're going into college, don't stress too hard. I know it can be nerve-wracking being a high schooler going into college. You're like, oh my gosh, it's a whole new world. But you will get used to it. The college will become your home, and I feel like this college is more my home than... My high school ever did i like college a lot you are a lot more free but anyways any on that i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so so much for watching and if you enjoyed please uh, subscribe to me and like this video and comment anything down below i'll be trying to post as often as possible with college um starting i'm gonna be juggling a lot of things but i'm going to try my best to post as often as i can i have a lot of videos planned i truly appreciate any of you who clicked on this video like i i'm just starting my YouTube journey and right now it's just a really like it's a hobby of mine like I find I find happiness in editing a video and then uploading it and then hopefully one day I'll have an audience you know but for now I'm just gonna upload this and hope it reaches at least one person out there to anyone who's in high school or in college or doing anything I wish you the best of luck in the rest of the year and whatever you might be endeavoring in and yeah so I guess I will see you all in my next video bye